y'all hey something like a trucker i am in port allen louisiana and i need to make sure that my truck is ready for the next load part of that is making sure that your trailer is clean now i do know that my trailer needs to be sweeped out because the last uh receiver left some of the uh some wood from the pallets and little pieces of the pallet that need to be removed so i'm gonna go ahead and sweep that out to show you guys what that looks like y'all something like a trucker i am in st francisville louisiana and this load is going to monticello arkansas it's about 307 miles in which we will actually have to stop in between to do a maintenance run to get the oil change so we're going to go ahead and head to the pilot right now so we can get the oil changed on it and then continue on to uh arkansas for our load so let's go And then when you call me tomorrow because the oil hasn't been changed, it's gonna be a problem. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cook some dinner. I'm gonna have a good night because I know somebody talks to me crazy. It's gonna be a problem. It's gonna be a problem. They're gonna need the whole oil. Mm-hmm. 
y'all it's looking like a trucker i am still in monticello arkansas at the receiver um and as i was leaving they actually had a load that's going out to louisville kentucky um there's a driver who had a load and his truck got disabled right in front of the dock so they're gonna go ahead and get a tow truck to push him back into the dock take the load off of his truck put it on the mine and i take it to louisville kentucky so right now we're waiting on the tow truck to get here to push him back and then at that point we'll go ahead and get loaded we will still go to loves after this to get the oil change um once we are loaded so that part does not change so i'll keep you guys updated as it progresses